I'm Latino Hollywood Mafia. It sounds so illegal, but we're gonna, actually it's not. We're going to be talking about that today on the show. Brian Robles is a member of FHM along with some students from UCLA. Drew and Joe are going to be talking to all of them today. And the toys, what is the connection? Brian, let's first talk about FHM. What is that? Uh, FHM stands for Filipino Hollywood Mafia. Uh, we're a social networking group for industry professionals that work in TV and film. Uh, and Only we, for Filipinos? Uh, yes. Okay. <laughs> but, uh, uh, but we're kind of an open group in, in those respects. But um, we've been around since 2008, and we get together to uh, do social events and uh, networking and, and, and charitable events. Right. And you just had an event last night. It was your holiday mixer. That's correct. With the social relevance, because then in comes the toys. Right. Well, we uh, we partnered with Philam Creative. Uh, we've done joint events with them before, and we were happy to do this event with them to combine our forces and come together uh, for a toy drive that we were very excited to do, and we were so happy to to uh, collect all these toys for them. And the toys, uh, we have uh, a lot of uh, contributions, donations from Disney. Can you talk to us about that? Because I'm so excited. Oh, well, you know, this came through at the last minute, and I was very excited about this. Um, I had a friend uh, of a friend. Mm -hmm. Well, one of, one of the uh, companies that... Uh, sponsored the event was Vuco Vaca, which is a which is a vodka company based in in the Philippines, and um, they had some connections and friends at Disney, and they came through with like two big boxes of toys. Wow, this is exciting! And you see a lot of these toys. These toys are going to make uh, kids very happy, kids in the Philippines particularly, and that's where uh, Drew and Joe come in because this is going to a specific Gawad Kalinga village. You know, I always talk to you about Gawad Kalinga. If that's where my heart is. Is, and that's where I guess these guys' uh, hearts are also. Um, let's talk about the community where these toys will go to. Yes, yeah, so this, these toys are going to a Cebu school in Pampanga, a, one of the GK villages there. And uh, we just chose a school because we knew that we wanted to give back to our roots mm -hmm. because our parents always t reminded us not to take things for granted to give back to where our parents came from to make sure that they have the same things that we could enjoy too. And I've talked about this before, Gawad Kalinga is about nation building, not just giving homes uh, to the poor, they also do values formation for kids. It's really a community building, teaching uh, camaraderie and teaching you know how to be in a community. But uh, why the toys? What do you think will the toys do for the kids um, in, in Pampanga? Well, uh, I mean, uh, a lot of the kids are, um, this will really help with um, getting their spirits up, you know, during this holy season and all of that, since these kids aren't exactly, you know, they're, they're, they're from, like, the poorest of the poor, and it's a chance to just really get their spirits up this holiday season, and really, since we're... We're um, starting a sort of a mentorship program between us at UCLA and with the kids at the Siebel School in Pampanga. And this is sort of a, a good way to sort of start things off, you know. Like, right. I mean, toys is sort of like going with the seasons since mm -hmm. holiday and toys right. and all that. But ultimately, what we would like to get up to is sort of, since we're, we're college students and education is very important to us, and so sort of aligning with GK's um, mission of, you know, nation building with helping them help themselves so that's why we wanted to help them with their education and then ultimately we want to get started with like educational materials as well as helping them with their studies. That's what I like. You know, it's so easy to be comfortable here because we're okay. We can eat. We have a house. We have uh, extra stuff for, you know, uh, uh, leisure, recreation and all that. But why is there a need to give back? Well, at least from my perspective and with uh, FHM and Philam Creative and, and just the community of Pinoys that work here in the industry, you know, we... It's, it, we all feel like a need to give back, you know, because, you know, as we come up, we want to be able to mentor younger people as well, but at the same time, knowing that, uh, that we can give back to the community really makes, it just makes everyone feel good. Right, right. So uh, how do we become involved with FHM or Philam Creative? Is there a membership? How do you become a member? Is there an application process involved? <laughs> well, with, I can only speak with uh, about uh, FHM. Uh, FHM. Um, 
We are, uh, we have a Facebook page. Mm -hmm. uh, and if you work in the industry, either TV or film, uh, an actor, a writer, a producer, or a publicist, um, you uh, can come out to one of our events. We have events uh, anywhere between six and eight times mm -hmm. a year. Mixers Mi and all that. Mixers. Also students, right? Students as well. I mean, like, you know, one of the things that we constantly talk about is is, is being mentors to the younger generation. Um, and it's fortunate. I, I've been fortunate to have some really great mentors uh, as I've come up through the industry. And um, it's re I think it's really, really important right. to do that to the young people. And two things come to mind, giving back to the community as well as investing in the community. And and that's what I think you're doing when you help Gawad Kalinga as well. Here's more information about them. Thank you so much. That's great. Thank you.